Everybody cannot work for channels. So that's yeah, the truth. They are good 11, players. 11. 11. Yeah, 11. Thank you very much. <laughs> I know you're proud with that. But that's the fact. You cannot yeah. really weigh the you cannot really weigh that fact. In the, the statistics are mm. there. But everybody cannot play in the EPL. Let's everybody talk about cannot play in, okay. in, in the Syria. Afcon, please. Afcon. Fine. You all just. I'd rather play for Al Ali. I'd rather play for Al Ali. I'd rather play for Al Ali. I'll play for Al Ali before. But it's okay. The Afcon semi-finals before us, Burkina Faso, Egypt, Cameroon, Ghana. Tell me two teams that I think will make it to the finals. Yeah, for me, uh, it's been very wonderful uh, following the trend. You know, like we said in the group stage, teams are very careful. When you get to the knockout stage, you make use of your chances. And that's why uh, when uh, Mbukani and uh, uh, Kabananga were it's wasting chances, chances yeah. uh, the Ayu brothers came into the party yeah. and they got it done. Now at the semi final is going to be very crucial. Mm. Cameroon, they have what it takes. Gradually, they started building. You see their defense line. It's very difficult to break into their defense mm -hmm. line. They may not be play, playing fantastic uh, football, but what they are doing, they are getting the results. Against Ghana, if Ghana does not take their chances, they will punish the Ghana. And they have the, if you look at the, even at the, at, the, at the extra time, they were just waiting for the penalties. The, you, you see what they are just looking for? Opportunities for them to just get whatever they need to, to do. If they cannot beat you at the regulation time, they know that if they get to the penalties, is a game of luck, and they got it against uh, uh, their last team they, they, they played. So for, for me, I look at Cameroon. If Ghana take their chances, now that even we don't have Guyan as the top striker, but the Ayu brother have come to the back. Mm. Atsu also have he helped them, even Wakaso coming. And Razak, the goalkeeper, he's been very fantastic at the back line. And so now Ghana, for me, mm. uh, it, we, we get it, they use their chances. But Cameroon, they are dodgy. You cannot just, mm. uh, you cannot just predict their style of play. For the second semi-final, it's a very difficult match call to call because we saw the Egyptians. The Egyptians have been moving steadily into the com competition and they've gotten to that stage. You don't rule them out. They are the best team in Africa in terms of uh, that have won uh, the championship, yeah. uh, six, six championship. And they, the last three editions, they were not there. And that's why they're having issues with CAF because broadcasting, right, they, they, they felt when they did not qualify, there was no need for them. So this, is, this year, they are the ton tournament. They are not asking for CAF to help them with their broadcasting issues. But on the field of play against Tunisia, they made use. It's in the last minute. Football is won at 90 minutes. I know. It three minutes. I wanted the Tunisians. I saw the, uh, uh, sorry, the Moroccans. Yeah. The, the Moroccans. I saw Averena. You saw the, 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 the flair he has brought to his team. New team. And he didn't put pressure on them because he said he was just going to enjoy himself. So Egypt got it done. Yeah. So I see Egypt. You see Egypt beating Burkina Faso? Faso. I see Egypt. Burkina Faso looks to be the f favorite. But I see Egypt. Even Burkina Faso got it late. You see Banste coming towards the, uh, mm. yeah, the, towards the last game. Yeah. But they've been consistent. They've been in three uh, uh, semifinals. For, 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 for Egypt, they are the team to beat. They're very solid side. They haven't they considered are the a goal. They are the yeah. team so with El Adri at the back. The defense yeah. line mm. has been solid. Mm. They are the team. And the one good thing that's helped them, you know, most of them play their trades in the, in the Egyptian uh, right. league. And also a few players, Mohamed Salah and other players, coming together to support the team. Egypt has been the quiet team that have been moving uh, and, 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 and they are almost there. Mm. Okay. Uh, that's for the AFCON uh, semis there. We'll see which of the teams go through uh, eventually. Let's go on a quick break now. When we return, uh, we'll have a look at what the papers are saying. Stay with us. For today in the English Premier League, mm -hmm. we have Bournemouth playing Crystal Palace, Arsenal, Watford, Burnley versus Leicester City. Uh, Middlesbrough will take on West, West Brom. Brom. In other games, uh, Austin, Sunderland mm. versus Tottenham, right. Swansea, Southampton, and Liverpool, Chelsea. That's the big game. So I was asking you, like, do you see Liverpool, you know, uh, stopping the rocks tonight against Chelsea? Are three bad games for them. They, they, they had a very bad run, mm. and uh, Klopp said everybody's not just being fair on them because they lost games, but they are, they are also in contention. Mm. They need to define their season today. Tonight is going to bring you back their confidence, right. and mm. also most of them are looking at the possibility of stopping a big team. A title contender, mm. what it does to your psychology, your confidence, and your aspiration mm. is so massive. So Chelsea have done it. They did it against uh, Liverpool. Have done. They did it against the top six team. Mm. They beat virtually all the top uh, uh, team this season. And this is at home. Let's mm. see what they can do. They're going to Chelsea, and you know against Chelsea, the first leg you saw the way they dismantled Chelsea. Mm. Now they want to prove it right today at home. Yeah, at Anfield. Yeah. So if if 
they cannot. Today we define their season. Yeah. Because it also go, if they lose this match, it's going to also say they are out mm. in contention. They are out of as many as in two other competitions. Two cups already. Two cups in, at, in succession. Mm. And even the APL. And their season is being to be. But for Chelsea, Chelsea have a team that has been involving. Even though our well, pundit said in their five, the, these five matches, they are to get, if they get 10 points, that is six points against All City and Leicester City. Then against Tottenham, Arsenal, Liverpool and Arsenal. Mm. You get a win, a lose and a draw. And they've got a loss against Tottenham. Now what they are left behind yeah. is a win and a draw. Mm. And they need to determine the, uh, their season. If they get 10 points out of the 15 possible points, yeah. then they are good for the title. Right. So today, they are going to determine if they need to get a win against Liverpool or even get a draw and get a win against Arsenal. They need four points in mm. these two games. Mm. So today is a decider That's to right. determine their fate. Pretty mm. tough fixtures for Chelsea also, but this is where their character will be tested. Let's As see if they, if they want to really go on to win. And for Liverpool, uh, they might just be having Sadio Mane back mm. in the team, which is a very good one for oh, club he uh, uh, mm. flew in last night uh, uh, yesterday evening yeah. and they, they, they said even it might not be psychology Cali fit or physically fit for the match but he's going to be on the bench it, the threat of Sadie Mane on the bench is also uh, something he, he also give that moral boost to the team but in all EPA is going to be wonderful tonight would you, would you play Sadie Mane tonight for me I'll play him second half Okay. <laughs> because he's in the competition spirit. He's in a, in a competition. He's just coming from a competition. And so if, if, you had, if they have not crashed that, you should have been playing the semi-final. Okay. okay. Let's do the papers, Austin. Let's I do mean, the papers. we're running out of time. Uh, we're having fun. I know. Just, <laughs> I mean, we, we, I, I told you, made it rain with each other. Let's talk. Let's see what the papers are saying this morning. Front page of the Sporting Life. Raw to Eagles. Lions are dangerous. You should of know that. They don't are. play with Lions. You don't play with Lions of Cameroon. <laughs> uh, this is the next opening for uh, the support Eagles and the head coach. Uh, uh, Gana Roy is saying, don't play with Lions. They are dangerous. Transfer day deadlines. Conte feels sorry for me. Feels sorry for Mikel. Mm. Sorry for the gods. Yeah, <laughs> you can say that again. Yeah. Quickly, quickly, uh, Sporting Zone yeah. is the next paper for review. It's all about China and Odeon, Igalo, Igalo Dwarfs. Mikel agrees 12 billion naira deal. That's massive. And we still have something on the World Cup qualifiers. Um, the indomitable lines of Cameroon vowing to devour the Super Eagles of Nigeria. So the only the one, only one story I talk about about is uh, the the Super Eagles coach. He has no excuse now. Yeah. He has seen the Cameroon uh, and he's uh, telling his players, definitely yeah, we know we have a match at hand. Mm. We must get a win, at mm. least a win in Nigeria, then go and not talk about whatever happens in Cameroon. Okay, okay. before we go, I'll stay in a couple of tweets. Uh, Larry says uh, it's going to be Ghana versus Egypt in the final. He says, mark mm. my words. Uh, mm. We'll see how that pans out. Mm. Um, Shewu Adamu, uh, he says, Odeon Zgaro's move to China is a nice one, provided he will get enough playing time. I wish him all the best. <laughs> look, how, look how Shewu has done. Now he'll be smiling. It's okay. Come to the show and smile. Thank you so much to be Manuel for coming around. It's always a pleasure to be here. Yeah. Um, okay. Mm. That's the end of the show now. Many thanks for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'm Tayo Salam. I remember to keep talking to us. I'm Austin Okuna. I'll be back again tonight to talk some more sports. But until then, in everything you do, remember. Let's keep talking sports by for now.